Hey YouTube, what's going on? Junior here, and I'm back again with another reaction video. Back again with another viewer request. If my voice sounds a little strained, it's because I'm fresh off of uh, heading up a concert this past weekend. Went and saw Marilyn Manson and Rob Zombie on their Twins of Evil tour. And uh, needless to say, I lost my voice after about 15 minutes. <laughs> But it was it was amazing. It was a, definitely a bucket list item for me. Uh, I'm sure you all know that Marilyn Manson is like my all time favorite artist ever. N needless to say, it was a very surreal experience. The whole thing seems like a weird fever dream now. Yeah, I can't even believe that it happened. Caught the drumstick though, so I have that physical, tangible item to remind me that it did indeed happen. Uh, anyways, I'm back again, and we are gonna be hitting up. Uh, a, a somewhat interesting band here, recommended by somebody through my Instagram, Lanalito Art. I'll put their profile or whatever in the description. You can check them out if you want. They're they're a pretty good painter, an oil painter. I don't know. They make cool art, so you should go check them out. Anyways, they sent me some interesting messages about a band they want me to check out. Starting off with a Russian, okay, Russian punk rock band, King and the Clown, and then the. Second project created by the second solo is called The King and the Fool. They gave a bunch of history. The album, their albums and such are concept works. Uh, the songs are retelling of like classic horror stories. They gave a whole list of songs for me to check out, which if I like this, I'm sure I will in the future. But the one I'm reacting to today is called Eight Men of Meat or Men Were Eating Meat or something by The King and the Joker, I think, which is the king. I don't know. I don't know which one it is. Okay. It, it's there are they're Russian everything's in Russian I dug around for some English lyrics and uh, I'm using the link that she sent me for the actual music video so again we'll check it out thank you so much to Lana Lito art Lana Leto Lana Leto Lana Leto art highly appreciated everybody else of course follow in their example leave your suggestions in the comments down below or wherever I guess and maybe I'll make a video out of it someday who knows <laughs> Okay. 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 I, I, I'm digging the vibes. I like the vibes. Uh, it's, what does it remind me of? It, it remind it reminds me of like folk songs or like drinking pub songs, which I guess makes sense seeing as they're in some sort of old timey folk pub or whatever. I would not have guessed this was from the late '90s. It sounds like it could have been from the '80s or something. But again, what do I know about punk? You know, it's it's, it's a genre that I, I really only have a surface knowledge of. I don't know. Either way, it's pretty fun, pretty enjoyable. The guy looks a little bit like Sid Vicious, um, just with less teeth, <laughs> I think. Yeah, a, a lot less abrasive and harsh than I was expecting. A lot more just very fun and, um, again, like a, like a drinking song. <laughs> I think so 
what I can tell, this seems to, again, be some a retelling of some sort of folktale. Uh, here's where I think we are in the lyrics. Men were sitting and eating at the table. The stable men gave meat for his guests. Everybody praised the meal, and the host was very cheerful. He was talking about his wife all the time. Men were eating meat, washing it down with beer. They didn't understand a thing from the stable man's speech. And that, that little bit's the chorus. And it goes on, I have found out lately, all of you, even if it may sound strange, the stable man spoke in a hoarse voice. You had affairs with my wife in secret. That's why I gathered you here. Then the chorus again, men were eating meat, washing it down with beer. They didn't understand a thing from the stable man's speech. And I think that's where we've gotten to so far. With the gist of what's going on is the story is that this stable man has gathered all the men that his wife had an affair with into a single place and is now uh, entertaining them and, and uh, providing them with food. I'm sure this will end very well. Okay. All right. Okay. Short and sweet. You know, keeping it nice and simple on... I tried to keep an eye on her. That's my fault. But tell me, isn't she tasty? Men were eating meat, washing it down with beer. They didn't understand a thing from the stable man's speech. So all in all, the stable man cut up his wife. I don't know. Just cooked her up and fed her to all the men that had slept with her behind his back. That is the... Uh, that is the story. Is there a moral to it? I'll let you decide. I mean, overall, the song, fun, enjoyable. I mean, it just is... It, it was... I, this, you know, again, despite it being in a different language, it was very catchy. The chorus section especially was, uh, was quite uproarious. The whole song sounds very fun. Like, like I said, as I've said before, like, uh, like a tavern drinking pub song. And this kind of very good-natured vibes contrasting quite nicely with the dark undertones of the actual subject matter which again coincides with the story itself because the stable man is kind of jovially entertaining his guests and kind of speaking about his wife the whole time and eventually reveals that he killed her and cooked her but because of the tone with which he is speaking none of his guests actually really listen or comprehend uh, what he's actually saying. So a nice parallel between the story and the actual aesthetic of the song itself. As far as I can tell, it's it's very it's it is uh, influenced a lot by like very, like early punk and stuff like that. Kind of threw me off because it did come out in 1998, which was kind of after the heyday of punk. At least in at least as far as I know, somebody. If you really want to, you can educate me on the correct history and sound of punk because I, it's not a genre that I'm actually overly familiar with. And I do want to get into it more, so if you have any more suggestions, of course, leave them down below. I don't know. That's uh, It's going to be a quick video today, guys. I don't have too much else to say. But if you like the video, of course, make sure to like it. If you like the channel, make sure to subscribe. Everybody have a great day. I'll see you some other day. And yeah. Gah!